recon flight from the Hell's Archers achieved a complete scan of the Kilrathi fleet. We've identified two heavy carriers, five cruisers, eight destroyers, four corvettes, and four troop transports. We can assume this is an invasion force, and complete control of the Vega system is their goal. With the loss of Fort Crockett, we can also assume the Kilrathi's next plans are to directly attack the main human city on Vega Prime. But the Kilrathi task force hasn't set a direct course to Vega Prime yet, and Intel has ascertained why. They don't yet have enough troops to take the planet. The Hell's Archers recorded the jump transits of another convoy of trooper transports into the system. The convoy is escorted by a unit of heavy fighters and is only hours from rendezvousing with the Kilrathi fleet. Even though we haven't received any response from HQ about reinforcements, we will commence a preemptive raid on the convoy before they hook up with their carriers. If we can wipe out this convoy, we can seriously hinder the Kilrathi's ability to take Vega Prime outright. The Bloodhounds and the Mudsharks will be working together for this mission. Phalanx will be the leader of Alpha Flight and will be in command of this strike. You are to engage any fighter escort, while the Thunderbolts and Bravo, led by Psychopath, will attack the convoy. Dismissed. Sounds like fun. Hey everybody, welcome back to Let's Play Wing Commander Saga. My name is Burning Earth Chris, and I'm going to be your pilot tonight. Alright, so... Fly to the Kilrathi Convoy's last known coordinates, locate them, and help the butt sharks blow it up. Let's get on to it. Alpha and Bravo Flight, you are cleared for takeoff. I got a wingmate. Okay, cool. Huh, okay, that's odd. I can't give them any commands. That's really weird. I'm sure it's fine. Lots of bogeys. Here we go. All fighters, break formation and engage hostiles. Yes, I do. Nice. Jesus Christ, everybody's getting kills on except me. I've only gotten like two so far. I'm sure that won't trouble at all. Uh, Thunderbolt, stop hump, stop humping, please. Oh, there goes Don.
Yeah, that cots are referred to as tank fighters, I believe. Heavy fighters, I should say. That's what, that's what the back cots are, they're heavy fighters. Okay, we got more Drouthy. Enemy reinforcements coming in. Lock and load on the firing line. Bye. Down he goes. Oh, damn it. Let's get rolling. <laughs> oh, we got company. I'm picking up five fat troop transports. Alpha breaking attack. Bravo, the convoy's on yours. Bravo, initiate attack plan Delta. What's attack plan Delta? Never mind. I'll probably find out. <laughs> nice. Once all the fighters are mopped up, we can help uh, Bravo wing out with the uh, with the convoy. Hey, get back here, you son of a... There we go. Impressive shot, Thank you. Ickle, is it? Is that how you say your call sign name? Ickle? <laughs> okay. That's a, that's a new one. With pleasure. Okay, let's get into it. I'm gonna try and disable their engines. This way they're easy targets for everybody else. Oh, psychopath. So calm and yet so violent. I love it. <laughs> oh, I just heard a torpedo go off. Yep, there it goes. 
Oh. Nice explosion, though. Oh, that one's still left. I'm probably not going to arrive in time to be of much help, but... Eh. Yeah, I still don't know what those dots are popping up next to the target indicator, but... I'm sure they're not that important, right? Right? Primary objective complete. Psychopath, I've got some large readings at the far end of my scope. You get that? Roger. Same here. They like I'm getting them too. I think we should check it out. Boy, boy. Army's control, we've picked up some sensor ghosts at extremely long range. Identity is unknown. It could be Karathi reinforcements. Requesting permission to take a closer look. Roger that, Captain. You have permission to proceed. Be careful. I'm always careful with Sweetie. Alpha, I've already updated your coordinates. Proceed to next waypoint. Let's get rolling, see what this is. Closing on the house kitchen jump point. Wow, look at all this junk. Up to fifth the party. Sheesh, I'll say. Definitely picking up some long-range contacts. I'm also picking up some smaller targets, possibly fighters. Assume hostiles. Bravo. Combat spread. Hey guys, that's no way to treat friends, is it? Ah. Uh... Damn. Disregard. Contacts are Confederation. Hey, isn't that the Bradshaw, the flagship of the Seventh Fleet? The one and only. At your service. Oh. I take it the Kilrathi attempted to set up a picket force here? Attempted would be the key word, flyboy. <laughs> we'll rendezvous with your carrier in a bit. We've got this area covered. You're free to go home, boys. All right. Sweet. The Vega system now has a pretty sizable amount of reinforcements there. Awesome. Let's go home. Mission complete. Yay. No place like home. Hmm. Repeat that again, Dorothy. God damn it. <laughs> Need clearance, TCS Hermes. Welcome back, Sandman. Always good to see another carrier, but you are absolutely correct. There's no place like Hermes. You are cleared to land. Damn it, Grey Wolf. Congratulations, gentlemen. You may have single-handedly warded off a full-scale planetary invasion. Thanks to you, 5,000 Kilrath Kilra troops can cross making Vega Vega Prime their own personal litter box off their list of things to do before they die. Now that we have some support, we have a chance to turn this entire cat invasion plan on its ear. Sandman, what happened to Don was not your fault, it was hers. She disobeyed your orders and she paid the price. Keep this in mind for the future. As a wing leader, you have authority over your charges. But once you fly subordinate to someone else, you obey his orders to the letter. Don't get too comfortable. With the Bradshaw now in the system, expect big things to take place quick as quick. Dismissed. Yes, sir. Acknowledging our request for reinforcements, 7th Fleet Command authorized the deployment of the Bradshaw Battle Group to the Vega system under the command of Admiral Jackson. We now have an equivalent force to challenge the Kilrathi's two heavy carriers. I'm sorry to report that our downing of those troop ships was not enough to discourage the cats from this invasion. Recon fighters from the Bradshaw report the Kilrathi fleet heading at flank speed toward Vega Prime with the remaining troop transports in tow. The Hermes and the Bradshaw will be launching an Alpha Strike within the hour. If we can attack them before they are ready, maybe it'll force them to deploy their dropships early and keep the bulk of their forces for fleet protection. Cat Killer will be leading the majority of our squadron under Colonel Walker in the upcoming strike. Viper, Grey Wolf, Sandman and I will be working with the Bradshaw's Valkyrie unit. They are an elite unit, boasting one of the highest kill ratios in the fleet. We will rendezvous with them at NAV-1. From there, we will hide in our polar orbit above Vega Prime, far away from the main battle. 
Our job is to intercept any dropships the Kilrathi try to land. We're going to finish what we started with those troop ships. Let's show those cats we won't tolerate one hairy paw in our soil. Dismissed. Okay, I, I want to preface this by saying that the Valkyrie Squadron is absolutely awesome. And uh, they have a really neat little quirk that I actually rather enjoy about them. Let's see what it is. So, intercept any Kilrathi captured missiles before they enter the atmosphere and accelerate out of sensor range, and prevent hostile vessels from reaching the planet at all costs. Let's go! You're cleared for launch. Just wait and see. By the way, I love classical music. Um, especially Two Steps from Hell. They do some of the best. Bloodhounds, this is Lieutenant Colonel Wagner. We're looking forward to working with you. Same here, Colonel. Let's see how good you guys really are. Is that a challenge, Major? Maybe. Well, who knew the Major knew how to flirt? Grey Wolf, maintain radio silence. <laughs> All units, looks like the cats are taking the bait. They're launching missiles and committing dropships while keeping most of their forces for defense. Colonel Wagner, I've plotted the optimal intercept point for the missiles. Transmitting coordinates. Proceed to next waypoint. Let's get rolling. Incoming captured missiles. Analysis reads as standard antimatter tip. This is nothing. All units break an attack. Save your missiles. Intercept those missiles before they reach Vega's atmosphere. You know, Valkyrie might say it's nothing, but uh, for me, sometimes it's easier for me to hit a missile when I don't have have a lock on it. I don't know. I don't know how or why, but. Eh, let's just shoot him down. Oof! Okay, that could have been really bad. That could have been a lot worse, but I'm glad it wasn't. Again, that could have been a lot worse. I'm glad it wasn't. There we go. Come on, how many more? How many more? Oof. Stop making me look bad. Sorry, Viper. Okay. Missile strike neutralized, and we're just getting warmed up. Colonel Wagner, the dropships have changed their course. They're now closing on the planet fast. Valkyrie and Bloodhound squadrons, proceed to Nav 3, then Nav 4. Follow this vector, and you should be able to intercept the dropships in the upper atmosphere. This could get hot. Are you ready for this, Colonel? The hotter the better, Major. That's what I'm talking about. I thought I told you. Radio silence. <laughs> Proceed to next waypoint. Yeah, with missions like this that are very close to a planet, it might be kind of hard to see some of the uh, ships that you're fighting. But still, nice view. Uh oh, fighters.
There they are, okay. He's done. I'm not sure if I got that one. Sheesh. Proceed to next waypoint. Alright, uh where's the next waypoint? I can't even see it. There it is. Okay. Alright guys, this next part's gonna be um a little fun. A little fun. I love it so much. <laughs> Alright, I'm gonna go for the shuttles. This is what I've been saving my missiles for, by the way. Watch your backside. You've got a guy following you. There goes another one. Roger that. <laughs> Gentle God, I love it so much. Good question. Roger that. There you are. Oh, okay, there it goes. That's the last one. This is Valkyrie. Enemy assault force destroyed. Good work, people. Just got word on the Alpha Strike. We destroyed four squadrons of fighters and nailed three capital ships. Any carrier kills? We 
We've got two torpedo hits on one. The cats are abandoning the fight and heading for the jump point. Woohoo! Excellent. Will we send a second wave? The cats are retreating as fast as they can. We'll be launching another strike before they can make their exit. If you return to base fast enough, you'll get to be in it. That's a wrap, people. They're going to feel the hurt now. Bloodhounds, we are done using you. Damn. Strange clips of you, like side by side, and doesn't even say goodbye. Major, do you feel used? Radio silence! <laughs> <laughs> All right, let's get out of here. Yeah, call the Valkyrie squad and eccentric, but they get the job done. Need clearance, TCS Hermes. Alpha Wing, looks like the Kilrathi are backing off. How was it working with the Valkyrie squadron? It was interesting. We are becoming regular ground shoot busters, aren't we, Bloodhounds? Too bad they don't award kills by the cat instead of by the ship. We'd be aces a dozen times over. Well done to all. I'll say one thing for the Valkyries. It's as hell, but they get the job done. Keep it frosted, fr gentlemen. I want everyone to report back here in half an hour. I'm about to attend a briefing with Colonel Walker to go over our role in this follow-up strike. See you in 30 mics. Dismissed. Yes, sir. If you like this video, consider becoming a patron at patreon.com slash burningearthyfx. Don't forget to like and subscribe. Thanks for watching.